Hey guys, well this is the third time I try to film this freaking Latina tag. Okay, so I'm gonna be doing a Latina tag. And I'll have it, hold on. Oh. I'm gonna extend my feet because they're gonna fall asleep again. Like in the last video that I made. Okay, so I, I've, it's not that I've never heard of this tag. I've heard of it once. It was like two years ago because like I've been watching YouTube for a long time. And then it's finally now that I decided to make videos, which is very stupid, but whatever. Um, um, what's it called? Whoa. I haven't made my January favorites, which I really want to make. I'll probably make it after next, this video. Yeah, okay. So, it's really, like, not that much stuff. I think it's all, well, it's a lot of stuff. Let me just say that. Um, I've just tried a lot of stuff now, 2012. I just think it's a new year. Forgot about all the bad things in life. And trying to make them into good things in 2012. Because we don't want that bad thing that we all know about to happen. So, yeah. I'm just going to get started with this because I'm super mad right now. I just, I've, this is my third time doing it. First time it was my sister blabbing. Second time it was, it was me blabbing. Third time... I zoomed in accidentally, and I couldn't zoom out, and I couldn't push the stop button. So, that was very weird. Fourth time now. Okay. When was the last time you were in Mexico? I was in Mexico 2008, which is now 2012, which was like four or 12 years. Four or five years ago. Sorry about that. Um, number two. Name one Mexican dish you enjoy the most and why. Oh, and this is only five questions, so it's going to be a short video. Just saying. Um, one Mexican dish that you enjoy in the, and the most and why? I enjoy pozole a lot just because my mom makes a bomb ass pozole and I really like it. Um, and why? Because my mom makes this chile that goes with it and it's super fucking good. Okay, love it. Okay, sorry about that. Okay, name one Mexican household item that best resembles our culture. Well, let me get started. Like, no. Um, best resembles our culture. Um, well, okay. This one is the one that I've been looking for. Because I was like, I was reading through these questions before. See, I have them in my little notebook that I made. Uh-huh. Okay. So, um. <coughs> I'm sorry. But, um. Okay, so there's this thing that my mom has that my grandma gave my mom. And it's called the molcajete. Which is just a bowl made out of rock, which is very cool. And it has um, legs, and it's not that big. It's about that tall. It's probably as tall as my, as my face, probably halfway, you know, whatever. And it comes with a rock, you know. And you smash the chile. You put chile in there, and you smash it, and it makes like a bomb ass chile. You mix, and you put salt, you put lemon, whatever. And, it, and she just makes this bomb ass chile. With the morcajete. And I just think that resembles our culture. Because um, I believe you could only get that in Mexico. So that's very cool. And I would totally like to use that anytime soon. Oh, I remember one time I used it when I was small. I accidentally, um, I didn't, I um, slammed on my finger. So I didn't get to use it again. Because, I don't know, because I was scared. But I think I'm going to use it again to see if I don't smash my finger. Do you know how to speak in Spanish? If so, say a phrase or two. Well, yes, I do know how to speak in Spanish. And yes, I am very impressed with speaking in Spanish. Because I speak Spanish very funny. It's not the language that's funny. It's my language, my voice that says it funny. So let me just say a phrase. Um, me amo Anaí y tengo 11 años. So I know most of my family, well... My sister, my half-sister, which is my sister, what the heck. And then my um, sister-in-law are going to say, oh, yeah, we've heard you talk. Yes, they have heard me talk. So, um, yes, I, I talk very funny. Um, what part of Mexico are you from? I'm not actually from Mexico. I wasn't born in Mexico. Even though I am a Latina because my mom is born from Me My mom and my dad are born from Mexico. So my dad um, and my mom were born from this thing or this place, not thing, place, place, called Michoacan. I don't know if you heard of it. If you haven't, yes. If you haven't, no. If you have, yes. If you haven't, no. So, I mean, 
I don't know what I just said, but I'm talking very fast. I don't know why, but yeah, if you guys um like this video, comment down below and I tag everybody that sees this video. You better do it. And if you guys do it, just put it as a video response down below. So I hope you guys enjoyed and yeah, bye.